Hey, we're Keith here. Welcome back to The Simpsons Tapped Out. We got the song update going on. It's not a major event, it's a short mini update, but still, I like it because it's summer and summer's awesome. So let me just tap and get some bonus donuts. Before we move in to the premium character, I'll just update. So the premium character is Paul Flart. It's the second character with the Mount Splashmore slide. Often he's a parody of Paul Blart, Mole Cop, which I've never honestly seen, but I heard it was pretty funny. And I looked it up because I was curious about just how good it did, like at the box office. It actually did really, really good. The budget was like $23 million, and it made like $180 million worldwide, which is pretty good. I think the way it works is that you take the budget and then you double it. So let's say it was 25, it would have to make about 50 million to break even. That's what I've always heard. I don't know how accurate it actually is, but it smashed that. And then the second one, the sequel didn't do nearly as good, but it still made profit. Every four hours, 135 and 15 XP respectively, indulge rating. Earns pool floaties, which I don't really care about. I just want the character. Standard. 100 and 50. I'll replace it. Oh, no, I got my chocolate thing in the way. I haven't moved it. If you want to check out that video, look for Chocolate Chapel. Yep. I'm curious about this slide. Heads up! I haven't been to a water park in so long. So that's where Bill is a premium character. If you step out of line, I'm sending you straight to a dunk tank drunk tank. Paul Flart. Spoiler. There's Homie. There's Brockman. Homie's free. Paul Flart is premium. Brockman costs real money. Whoa. This is so fancy. But you have so many choices. Three choices. If I were to pick one, mm, looks like the blue and the purple one are pretty much the same. I think the blue one is a little bit more twisty. So I think the purple one is probably like the beginner. Blue is like the medium. And then the pink one is definitely the advanced one. All right, I will tap Paul Blart in just a second, but I have to tap the slide. What's it gonna sound like? Kids, hopefully not crying. Kids laughing. Sliding down that slide. Forging safety inspection certificates. With the weekend rush over and all of repairs completed, I guess you can finally relax. Did you just put repairs in air quotes? Our lawyers said I'm legally required to. Wait, why are you air quoting lawyers? Oh, because no real lawyers want to work with us anymore. So technically our lawyers were just me looking stuff up on the internet. Well, anyway, if there's nothing going on, we might as well enjoy a few water park perks. We should check with the HR department first. Now you're air quoting HR? So are you doing that job too? No, we have an HR department. All right. Enjoy water park freebies. Which is animated. So let's just back up that trolley. And let us try to figure out what this animation is going to be. Assuming they're going to go there. Now it is animated, which means they're going to actually be seen here. Where they're going to be seen, I don't know. They could be right there. They could be in the water. They could be way at the top. I doubt it. Well, they'll probably be like in the front or something. Right over here, right where the gate is. Or... Oh, never mind. I thought you were going to go to the water park. No, you're just going to stand there and do the animation. Let me just hide everything. There they be. So, it looks like it hit him in the face. 
We got an ice cream cone. It's mint flavored. There's another one. Ooh. Right in the face. So we got the ice cream cone. The water gun. Even though I thought the water gun, there was a water gun one. And then what was the third one? I think it was sunscreen? Yeah, sunscreen. Once again, right in the face. And yes, that's totally sunscreen. Mr. Flart, a crime has been committed over by the ankle soaker. Ugh, I've only gotten to go down Mount Splashmore 300 times. I guess water park crime never sleeps. Flart, get over here. There's been a crime. Why are you... Whoa! Slips and falls. Oh, yeah. Be careful when you walk. That happened to me, too. Luckily, I had loot to fall on. And now I have a broken ankle. It's not broken. It's sprained. Anyway, someone stole all of your water park's non-slip mats. Whoops. Slips and falls. My other ankle... If you're already here, Chief, what do you need me for? This isn't my jurisdiction, Flart. I handle land crimes. This is a water park crime, and you're the water park cop. That's not how that works. Come on, Lou. Let's get some ice cream. Yeah, you can put it on your ankle. Or ankles. Look for clues. Eat free ice cream. Can I have free ice cream? It's quite hot here at the moment, like probably for a lot of people around the world. Look for clues. Alright, so we got our second and final animation. Are you going to finally go to the water park? You're not. But, I do know he uses one of those things in the movies. So he's looking around for clues. The culprit, the non-slip mat stealer. So I just realized Wiggum is probably going to go here. So for the animation, uh, maybe just kids. Flying out of the bottom, maybe? Yeah, we'll get generic NPCs flying out at the bottom. Having fun. Hopefully no broken ankles. Whee! Oh, she's going down the purple one! Going down the purple one again. What about the other one? The pink one? Going down the blue one. Remember what I said in the beginning. Purple is probably beginner. Blue is medium. And then the pink one is probably... Oh, there she goes! She's advanced. She can do it all. I didn't find any clues, Chief. I have no leads. Where you're going, you don't need leads. What does that mean? I don't know, but it sounded helpful in my head. Oh, I thought it was going to be like Paul Flart. I was going to say Blart. Took the mats without realizing it. Okay, we've got no leads, no clues, no nothing. But clues are always tricky to find. Maybe you should take a closer look at the crime scene. A closer look? Isn't that what we've been doing? No, all you've been doing is running around the park on your scooter. Scooting around is part of my process. It helps me think. Look for clues. Eat more ice cream. Ah, uh, yeah. What's your theory on how the crime took place, Lart? Examining the crime scene again, I would say that the perpetrator was wet when they executed the heist. Hmm. Wet, you say? Then there's the investigation considerably. But that conclusion is obvious. The non stop match were in a pool of water when they were stolen. Wow, Flart, you really are good. Don't think I don't notice your face there, Wiggum. Picks up a fish scale. Oh, hey, look, an actual clue. Obviously, the match was still by a fish. Or maybe someone who works with or around fish. Hey, the sea captain knows a lot of fish. Maybe he has something to do with it. Time to solve a crime. Sea captain took it? That would kind of make sense, actually. 
Seek you after and find a fishy alibi. Well, maybe he did take the meds. I ain't at citrus for weeks, and I'm raring for a kill. Why would I want to steal mats? What would be my motive? Does your ship's deck ever get slippery? Arr, tis always slippery. Well, then there's your motive right there. You stole those mats and put them aboard your ship. Fine, that is actually a good motive, but you are missing one important fact. How did I steal them? You swam off with them. How would I be swimming with the mats when I can't even swim? You can't swim, but you're sea captain. I have a peg leg and only learned to swim froggy style. But you could have put a fin on your peg leg, couldn't you? Look, I wasn't even at the water park the day of the crime. I was at the squid port, comedy barrel doing their open mic night. You do stand up comedy? No, I sing comedy sea shanties. Oh, okay, I'm not gonna try to sing. My name is Horatio McAllister, commander of the Queens Fort Garrison. Way haul away, we'll haul Horatio. But most call me the weird Al of shanties, and welcome that comparison. Way haul way, we'll haul Horatio. Wow, you're actually pretty good. Doing the chorus too, respect. Thanks. You're still my prime suspect though. The sea captain's alibi checks out. Whoa! Slips and falls. Oh, yeah, the plugs and mats were also stolen. Who is doing this? We need a lead. Before you go riding around on your scooter again, there's an actual trail of water leading away from the crime scene. Finally, a trail. You're going down, unknown thief I haven't caught yet. Ooh, who's it gonna be? Is it going to be Wiggum? Is that too obvious? Could be Lou. Maybe he wanted time off. So he faked his injuries. Before I doubt this, let me know down below, if you've gotten this far in the video, who is your prime suspect? Who do you think it was? Let me know. The trail leads to King Snorky. I should have guessed. It's always King Snorky. It wasn't me. I swear on my mother's blowhole. I don't know what that means, but it's very convincing. I believe you didn't do it. He's holding the mask behind his back. Yeah, okay, you got me. Why'd you do it, Snorky? Do you know what these things go for online? As climate change destroys our coast, the sidewalk gets slippery. But what's the first thing people need? A uh, moving track to move away from the flood coast? non of mats. Really? That seems like a stretch. No, it's the real deal. I'm selling these babies for 50 apiece. And there's thousands of mats at this water park. I'll look the other way for a 50% cut. 10%. Deal! I'll take it. What about my share in all this? Let me ask my other secret partner. Give him 5%. I knew you had something to do with this. Okay, okay. I, I get the point there, Sea Captain. You're a beautiful singer. And there we go. That is the full walkthrough of Paul Flirt. That was actually very, very long. Longer than I thought it was going to be. It was a five-parter, which is good. A lot of times I do three now, and it kind of just doesn't make it as good because you can't really flush out the quest line as well. You can see what happens with five parts. This was a really good quest line. It was like a who done it kind of thing and let me know down below like i said were you right about king snorky and the sea captain as a secret partner let me know i really enjoy the water park really more than the animations i'm not gonna lie like i said i love the fact that there was like the nbc who just randomly goes down the slide and they went down all three of them which was amazing so yeah paul flart 150 donuts available for the rest of the update if you want to go for them like comment and subscribe for more tapped out videos now we'll see you with more Pre characters and more, and these splash and burn updates in the future. So, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye, everybody.